Hi guys, the Puppy News here, and guess what just arrived in the mail? I've been waiting so long to get this. It's a home blood type kit, as you can already tell from the title, but anyway. It comes with, um, as you can see, one Elden card, four Elden sticks, one cleansing swab, one automatic lancet, an Elden foil, one plastic dropper, one absorbent cotton ball and instructions. So let's open it. So, yeah, as you can see, I just unpacked it and here are the instructions. I already read them already, so yeah. Firstly, we cut the, um, we get the Elden card out. So I'm going to just cut. And now I'm going to take the Elden card out. See, as you can see. It contains four different circles on which you can see, and I'm just going to write my name on it. Now we take the pipette and we place a drop of water on each of the circ um, four circles. Yeah, I have water. Make sure you put it on the coloured section. And now, um, we twist the safety um, cap thingy of the lancet. And here's the alcohol swab where I just opened. And then you swab the area where you want to disinfect where you're going to cut. Which is my ring finger in this case. It smells weird. Yeah, and then it says to leave it to dry. Leave your hand finger to air dry. And I'm just gonna wait. Okay, now it's the scary bit where I have to prick my finger. It says to put your hand down and then you just place it near there and then you press down. That actually didn't hurt that much. It felt like a stinging pain. And as you can see, blood is coming out. So just hold it. Now you collect one of the Elden sticks. I have my assistant here, click my sister. Collect it. Ah, uh, it's running. And place it into the first circle and um, leave it there. Oh my gee, it's running, dripping. I have to be quick. Make sure you don't use the Now we get the um the, the swab cotton swab that they use to wipe your blood. And now we start stirring. Stir each circle for ten seconds. Okay. Now after we have done this, we take the things off and we hold it down for 10 seconds. Then we flip it upside down and leave it for 10 seconds. And then we do it like this. Okay, and now we can have a look at the results. If you look here, you can see there's no agglutinated circles, nothing clumping. The D looks sort of like it's clumped, but it could be just like a really weak clump. I'm not even sure.
it's I'm either O positive or wait or O negative. I'm not sure because it's it said early in destructions that there were some certain type of people who have very weak agglutinates, so only specialized laboratories can detect um, such weak D antigens with certainty. So I'm either O negative or O positive. You may think that it's like faulty or anything because nothing's happening, but I bought the same kit for my sister who did it earlier and she got this, meaning she's A positive. See, something does happen. So thanks for watching and don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Bye!